The legend lives on from opensource.com of the video they call the top five. Community moderator Ben Cotton here with the opensource.com top five articles for the week ending November 10th, 2017. I'm not saying this is the best top five I've ever done, but it has Microsoft, the GPL, deep learning, and more. Let's take a look. Coming in at number five, what's the difference between open source and free software? There are related terms, but even rainy day people know there are important nuances between how the terms are used. Scott K. Peterson explains the differences. Our number four article this week is, what is the TensorFlow Machine Intelligence Platform? Amy Unruh gives an intro into this open source library for machine learning and deep neural networks research. If you're interested in this rapidly growing field, you'll want to give this a go-go round. The middle article in our top five is Getting Started with .NET for Linux. It's sundown for the days of Microsoft as the evil empire. Don Shank gives an introduction to using the .NET framework on Linux. At number two, Shedding Light on Foggy GPL Licenses. It's not early morning rain, but unclear license statements can cause confusion. Jeffrey Robert Kaufman shares some tips for making your licensing more clear. And our top article this week is How to Use Cron in Linux. Community moderator David Both gives an explanation of using Cron to run regularly scheduled tasks on your Linux system. If you need to run a command east of midnight, this is the article for you. Thanks for watching. I have to go take a trip down Carefree Highway now, but come back next week for another video and be sure to check out all the great content on opensource.com. If you can read my mind, love, you'll notice I sprinkled in some Gordon Lightfoot references. Let us know how many you caught in the comments below.